Let me give you the background if you're not familiar with the high-speed rail. First of all, the high-speed rail is something that's not needed. We already have trains. It's going to make uh, the train trip a little bit quicker. It's not really worth it when you take a look at what it's costing you. Now, the funding for the high-speed rail already, back in 2008, it was supposed to start, and it was going to take eight years best-case scenario, 11 years worst-case scenario. So here we are now, 2014. What are we looking at, two years away from being done? Nope. Is it worst-case scenario then? 2020 will be done? Nope. Now they're thinking 2030, 2035 range. So it hasn't even begun yet, and now it's almost tripled the amount of time that's going to take. Now the initial project was going to cost $33 billion, with a B. Then 2011, they said, well, we're wrong on that number. It's going to be $68.4 billion. Then in 2012, a year later, they set up a little bit more. It's going to cost $91.4 billion. And they have been funded already in four years. This is what I can't understand, and I couldn't even do it. If you came to me and you said, I need you to be corrupt, here's what we're going to do. We have a scam. We're uh, going to build this high-speed rail. It's, we're going to inflate the hell out of prices, and we're going to keep getting paid ridiculous amounts of money to develop this high-speed rail that it, there's no way it's necessary to cost this much. But here's what I need you to do. I need you for four years. We're not going to start construction. And I need you to spend $10 billion. Now, l- let me uh, just kind of explain to you what that number is. You hear $10 billion. That means it's $2 billion, a little bit more than $2 billion a year. That means it comes to about $200 million a month. $200 million a month, which is... $50 million a week, $10 million a day. That means $10 million every single business day. You need to spend on this high-speed rail and not even start the thing, but you need to make it look legit. I couldn't even do it. I would back away. I'd say it's impossible. You can't do that, but that's what they did. They were funded $4.7 billion when it began in 2009. Then 2010, they were given $2.35 billion in the stimulus package. The following year, uh, $1.2 billion was rejected by the other states in the stimulus package. Said they didn't want the money, so instead of not spending that money, then they gave it again to the stimulus package. And then the Department of Transportation, the same year, gave them another $2 billion. 